I think it's so important to remember that we are not only judged for our sins, but we're also judged by our sins. Let me explain this to you. And I realize that for some of you here, it's like sins. Sin is missing the mark. Anything that is just off from God's perfect will, that's what the Bible calls sin. But we're judged for our sins. And that always speaks of that when we stand before God after we take our last breath and that we are have to give an account for our life. And we are judged for those sins because God is perfect. God can say, that was wrong. Even though we live in a day and age that says, you can't say what's wrong, God can say it. And God has said it in his word. So we are judged for our sins. But guess what? you're also judged by your sins. And what that means is that when we live our lives in rebellion against God, we don't have to wait until the future for judgment because we actually experience the effects of the mistakes and the sins that we commit on this side of life even before we experience judgment for them in the next life. So here's the key. Follow Jesus and don't sin. It's pretty simple. By the Spirit, we just want to keep following Jesus. God bless you.